but you're, te- you're, you're taught the language of, of ex-slaves who are now mentally, physically, spiritually enslaved. So the language that they're speaking is the language of disempowerment. You're talking about what can't happen. And then if you say something like magic, oh, don't say that. You know, you don't want to get into that magic. You know, black magic is that. Black magic is the ability to go into the darkness and recreate yourself. Form like Darkness is where everything comes, but they scare you of your own power. So everything is about fear. So the average person grew up in a family that lived in fear. They were had inferiority complex, right? And once you have that inferiority complex, you teach it to the children. Nobody's taught that the, 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 I remember I used to go, have to go outside and pick those dandelions out the grass. They had a special little tool. My father would say, go out there and get rid of those dandelions. Little did I know that these dandelions, because every once in a while, I'd take one and eat it. Yeah. Something just said, eat it. My father said, you're not, you're eating those things? Well, they're good. I like them. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> then we find out that dandelion is so important to help regenerate the blood, help the kidneys, the liver, and the spleen. Yeah. This is medicine. But why do we get it out of the lawn? Because they had a law that they created that said that anything other than grass could not be in your front yard. It's called the Beautification Act of America. Mm.